introduce yourself. I'm Tori, and I'm Winter, and this is True Cherishment 15. So today's topic is honesty and lies. Know how to satisfy, keeping the temple right without you. Yeah. Oh, honesty. What? What is honesty? <laughs> <laughs> um, it's just like telling the truth. <laughs> yeah. Just that, like perfect. That's what I was looking for. Okay, so what are lies? Um, things that you say to get out of telling the truth. I think lies are, um, either you're too scared of the consequences of telling the truth, or you don't want to tell the entire truth, so you just, mm, I can just <laughs> tell the short little lie, no one will get hurt in me. So, why are people honest? Because they know that it's the right thing to do, and they don't want to end up hurting someone in the long run by lying. I think it's, when you are honest once, it's just easier to be honest from there on out. Because it's easier to live that way than trying to keep track of all your lies, and that gets stressful. It's like, oh, I told this person that I like them. <laughs> It means I have to be nice to them. Yeah. And it's like, oh, wait, now I'm hanging out with this person <laughs> who's also their friend, so I can't talk bad about that person and be like, that person really doesn't like you. And it's like, no. Mm -hmm. You just tell them, mm, I don't like you. <laughs> and then you go on your way. So, why do people lie? Um, I think they want to get out of doing something and they think that it'd be easier and sometimes they think that they'd actually be helping another person by lying to them when in reality it'll just come back to bite them. I think people lie. I'm going to get But um, I really think that people lie because they're scared of telling the truth or it's just to come so naturally where they've been in environments where they've always been lied to or um, lying was a way to get out of really bad trouble and so they yeah. just go to it because it's comfortable to them and they don't know that it can really harm them or harm their relationships. So, how does honesty better people? Um, I think all around it just, like it helps their relationships with other people stay healthy and strong. And also, it helps their conscience because they won't feel guilty about lying to people. Mm -hmm. I have a question about that. Wait, what? No. It's like right in my stomach. <laughs> what was that? No, it's not fair. <laughs> That's like a. I don't think so. <clears throat> yeah. So, <laughs> um, I think honesty can better people in like numerous ways. Um, in relationships, if someone keeps doing something that you don't like, then if you just go up to them and you're honest and you say, I don't know, like, you keep leaving all the lights on in the house and the bill is like five billion dollars. <laughs> and you just tell them, like, give them honest reasons why you don't like it. Mm -hmm. Then usually, if they really care about the relationship, they'll try to make an effort. But, I mean, if they're like me and they're, you know, their memory is kind of, woohoo, gotta cut them a little bit of slack there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just a little bit. But they should still try to make an effort. Oops, I didn't mean to. So, um, another way that honesty can better people is I feel like you're just more free when someone comes up. And I feel like more people will ask for your opinion on stuff. Probably. So just be honest. Yeah. Versus saying, oh, it looks so good, and it looks like, <laughs> <laughs> or if you're like, saying, oh, I think I should um, date this married man, and you're like, if that's what your heart tells you to do, just say, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. do you think it's a good idea? And you're like, well, it could be. No. No. <laughs> yeah. You just look at the person and say, No. <laughs> So, how do lies ruin people? Um, they can ruin all of your relationships with other people. And they can really hurt others. 
and it could also hurt yourself when you find out that you're like all alone because of all of your lies. Yeah. Um, have you ever been caught in a lie? Yeah. I have to. I've started. <laughs> I've started to lie, and then I was like, <laughs> I was about to tell you this lie, but <laughs> yeah. I just tell you the truth. It's like I don't want to go there with you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's like I want to go there. I just not with you. <laughs> I feel bad because my honesty is like so brutal and I'm like it's like I see why I'm thinking of this lot right here because that is how am I going to change that to come out nice or at least kind because what I'm really saying is that um I enjoy being around you so like hmm I'm related to this person so what do I say that also fun trying to figure out ways how to True. say nicer versus like lies. I think lies are easier to tell than the truth. Yeah. So see that's not a challenge. Let's no try to be honest and be kind about it. That's the real challenge. <laughs> yes. Oh, I had an epiphany. Oh god. Oh my gosh. Okay. So Two hardest things in life. First challenge, living amongst idiots. Are you just gonna be quiet? So we're talking about how lies ruin people. Yes. Well, if you're not honest, then you end up with people like that. <laughs> <laughs> See how I tied that back in there? Yes. But I really do think that lies ruin people. <laughs> Okay. When is it easiest to be honest? Um, I think it's easiest, like, when you're talking to someone you really care about and you know that you have to just be straight with them. And, like, they mean a lot to you, so you know if you lie that it'll ruin the relationship and that it's just the most important to be honest to them. Yeah, I think it's most important or easiest to be honest whenever you're dealing with a situation that's, like, really deep, like, if someone's, um, it could be, like, suicide, or mm -hmm. they're talking about doing drugs or something, and you really care about that person, I think it's easiest because you put, like, all that aside, and you're really yeah. thinking about this person, and if I do lie to them, how's that gonna ruin their life, and so on. Um, when is it easiest to lie? Um, probably, like, when it'll get you out of trouble. And you know that it would just make your life a lot easier to just lie rather than tell the truth. Yeah. When it's like, seems like the quickest way out of something. Yeah. Versus just, oh, if I tell this person this, and this is going to happen, and then this, and then this. It's kind of like when the principal comes to you about a situation that you're a witness of. If you're like, oh, I, was like I wasn't there, I didn't see nothing. I don't know why I'm in here. <laughs> I didn't see nothing. <laughs> Chris is saying, Toby smacked her. <laughs> then you gotta stay there for like two hours and then bring Toby in. Toby's like, <laughs> I'll smack you next time. <laughs> I, have I ever been in a situation like that? Nope, not with Toby. <laughs> I mean, there was this guy who did something to my friend and I was like, okay, you don't scare me. <laughs> okay, and so that was easy because I was just like, Yeah, he did it. You're gonna talk about a time that you were honest. Was it hard? I don't know. Um, not honest, Tori? <laughs> no, never. I lie all the time. <laughs> A time you were honest. Okay. So, I mean, like, when my friend needs advice. Okay. About relationships and life and stuff. Was it hard to be honest then? I mean, sometimes, because I don't really know what I'm talking about all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I go there.
same amount of time. She'll start talking about something. I'll be like, I want something good. And then it's like fades away. I'm like, uh, I like cheesecake though. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I'm telling I was honest. Let's see. It is kind of hard to think of a good juicy yeah. time because I mean, there's so many times you could just be like simply honest and be like, and your mom's like, did you take out the trash? And you did, and you're just like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like, did you go to school? Yeah, but I didn't like it. <laughs> mm, let's see. A time that I was an honor. Well, okay, this one's not that big. Someone dropped a nickel, and then I picked it up. <laughs> and I set it on the counter, but they, it was weird though because they dropped, they like dropped their change. And I was like, uh oh, because I always do that in public. Because <laughs> I'm weird, and it like hit my foot, and I was like, oh hello. And I was like, it's not mine. <laughs> it must be yours. <laughs> and then like he was like bent down here. I was like, my because <laughs> my vagina was like kind of like right above his head, and then he kind of like tilted it up. And it was like. <laughs> it was awkward. <laughs> Could have been less awkward to hang on. I probably would have been, <laughs> been like, shimmy. If I knew it would Yeah. I did it. True. So. And he was like, oh, I'm going to be He was like, 12. Oh, God, that makes me He probably would have been scarred for that. <laughs> I didn't pat his head because that, <laughs> that would be. <laughs> I'd probably be traumatized if that happened to me as well. <laughs> he probably would never be able to look at nickels again. And then if he dropped change, he'd probably like flash back and get like big eyes and be like, mm, it was that time we cook out. <laughs> that that <girl. laughs> the time I was just like big time honest because I'm not my life is not yeah all that same <laughs> oh. <clears throat> oh no because I did that assignment I was gonna say that time where I told the teacher I was I had to do that assignment because I didn't want to do that assignment but I had lots of dreams like that <laughs> <clears throat> I have I'm a pretty cool kid in my dreams. <laughs> oh, but yeah, that's all I have. So I'm going to answer this how do lies ruin people in one sentence without going off okay. the topic. Go. Okay. Lies ruin people because. This is farther than I thought. <laughs> lies. <laughs> Dang it, I messed it up. <laughs> You're cutting that out. <laughs> I can do this. Lies ruin people because they allow people to cover up what really needs to be said. That's real. The truth. Yes. That's what they do. Yeah. Pivot people. That's what they do. They're limiters. That's what they do. Yes. They're limiters. They're just being honest. Then you can do whatever you want. No, not really. <laughs> no, you won't. I almost said lions. I was so close to being which <laughs> lions do too, so either way I would have been if I was a lion either. I'd be so weak. I'm just thinking of me. Imagine me as a lion. I'd be like the sassiest lion. <laughs> okay, you're gonna need to cut this part. <laughs> I probably like change people like for like one mile. <laughs> they like, get tired. <laughs> Me. <laughs> be like, oh, I'm this sassy line. I'd probably just like sit in front of someone's car and be like, oh, that's the endangered lion species. And I'd be like, sit right in front of it. And be like, <laughs> <laughs> rawr. <laughs> yeah. rawr. <laughs> what was it? <laughs> How does it? Okay. Um, okay. Let's move on to the next question because obviously every time I go back to how do 
people, right? Groom people. <laughs> <laughs> Goes to the <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Which is not. <laughs> 